No, but uh, we learned uh, the uh, Lagrange multipliers methods. Let's go back to our uh, problem of uh, welfare maximization. So to recall the problem, we have to maximize the welfare that depend from the utility of two individuals, but in turn, this utility depends from their level of uh, consumption. And all this choosing the level of uh, these two levels of consumptions, knowing that we have a sort of budget constraints, that the total consumptions must be equal to the amount of goods available. So this is a, a, a constrained uh, maximization uh, problems. And uh, here is the first uh, results that we can uh, show. Uh, that the marginal uh, contribution to social welfare from each individual's uh, uh, consumptions must be uh, equal. Uh, this is indeed the uh, um, marginal contribution to social welfare from uh, individual consumptions, that is uh, This one is this one, and uh, the same for individual B. And then from the chain rules, you obtain that this uh, amount is equal uh, to, uh, to the terms in the equations that are reported. So how do we uh, arrive to, uh, to these results? Well, nothing else than uh, starting, uh, then forming the, the Lagrangian uh, for, uh, uh, for the problems. And uh, when we uh, take the first derivative, uh, first order derivative of the Lagrangian for uh, the two, uh, um, uh, two decision variables, we have that both must, the, both uh, the marginal contribution to social welfare of the individual consumptions must be equal to lambda and hence must be, uh, must be equal. And uh, something to note here is that uh, this result is a very general result. It doesn't really depend even from the particular form of the social welfare function. So whatever uh, form we choose, this result stand. Let's now move from a, a model of a single period of time to a multi-period uh, model. In the most general form, uh, social uh, welfare uh, functions will be of a form like this one. That is, the social welfare will depend from the utility of uh, individual A uh, that lives at time zero, the individual B living at time zero, the individual C uh, living at time zero, but also to the individuals that lives at time one and so on of all the individuals that lives at any given moment of time. To be more uh, uh, specific, we can assume uh, social welfare functions uh, for welfare of this form where uh, the utility of people living at any given moment of time is discounted by this discount term one plus rho. Uh, one note here, I kept the uh, uh, notation of the uh, reference book that I'm using. So here is you, but really this is not the utility. This is already the welfare of all people living at, uh, uh, at the moment of time one. And the way that the intra-period uh, 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 social welfare function is formed really doesn't, uh, uh, doesn't enter into, it's not specified, doesn't need to be specified for the results that we are going to, to show. So uh, two important notes is that we keep assuming that utility in each period is a is concave function of, uh, of the consumptions and uh, that is the first derivative 
is positive more we consume and this is the aggregate level of consumption at any moment in time it, it, the utility increase but increase in a, a marginal uh, marginally uh, decreasing way the other important assumptions we do is that uh, the utility as a function of consumptions it doesn't really depend directly from the time and here i did stress directly because it actually does depend from times because a different moment of time we are different we are possibly different uh, amount of consumption and so the utility itself it has this time index because it's changed with a different uh, 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 period of time but the way that the utility depend from the consumptions this one remain constants doesn't change with time we now switch for uh, computational convenience from uh, the discrete time notation we used in the previous slides to a uh, continuous time uh, notation and we assume a uh, infinite uh, time horizon uh, that's why we can uh, rewrote the question of the previous slides in uh, in these terms using the discount rate again uh, row.